Last week, the anti-corruption unit headed by Lieutenant Colonel Edith Nakalima stormed Bank of Uganda. At least eight officials were arrested. Nakalima said in a statement then that the arrests had been carried out in liaison with the CID and Bank of Uganda to conduct a special investigation on the matter pertaining the bank's procurement and supply chain activities. Bank of Uganda Governor Emmanuel Tumsime Mtebide said he had requested the anti-corruption unit of State House to investigate the matter after his staff discovered the anomaly. The same day government spokesperson Ofono Pondo pointed out that the Minister of Health was one of the other owners of the excess cargo in question. The items of UN and USAID and Minister of Health are things related to electronics. We suspect maybe there could have been a supplier who, who brought the goods and tried to indicate that they were destined, they were headed to the Ministry of Health. In a press briefing this morning, police spokesperson Fred Enanga revealed that the Criminal Investigations Department is taking over the investigations into the matter. Six people are still in custody. The directorate will, however, continue working alongside. Uh, the anti-corruption unit of State House to accomplish the investigations. Police is recording statements from officials of the Uganda Revenue Authority and enhanced company that handles cargo at Entebbe International Airport. Others are yet to be summoned. Uh, the UN and uh, selected business persons who are being mentioned uh, as far as these transactions are concerned. The cargo in question was brought into the country on the 27th of April 2019. Ali Mivule, NTV.